Aquatic ecology is the study of our water bodies, what lives in them, how they function, how they're connected and what affects them. And from that how we can look after them and restore them from a local scale all the way up to a catchment scale. Our health and wellbeing is integrally linked to the environment that we live in. And as New Zealanders, we're really lucky to have these amazing natural landscapes that are protected out there on our conservation estate. But within our urban areas, we also have our rivers and waterways that can be these amazing natural environments that can enrich our everyday lives if they are healthy and functioning. So if we look after our rivers, they will ultimately give back to us. The Otakaro Avon River has always been a core part of Christchurch, but sadly as a city we haven't always looked after it. So the reimagining of the red zone is a wonderful opportunity for us to turn around that history of degradation. And to do that for our rivers, we need to look at ways that we can give space back to the river, that we can allow the river to breathe and function properly. Things like pushing back those stop banks, allowing the river to flood, to reconnect it with the floodplain, which is a natural part of a properly functioning river ecosystem. We can look at the cloaking of our river with native vegetation to shade the water, clean the water, and also provide habitat for those beautiful native birds that we have. We can also look at the buildings and infrastructure that we create in these areas, make sure that they are cleaning the stormwater and not putting contaminants in, that they're set well back from the river edge and sit lightly on the land. And ultimately, we need to remember that messy is good, that nature loves variety, so we need to have changes in channel width and depth, lots of logs and rocks and overhanging vegetation. They all create that really important habitat that's needed for a healthy system. One of the key things that we can all do if we want to look after our waterways now is to recognise that everything we do on the land affects our waterways. So for the Otakaro Avon River catchment, there's an entire catchment upstream that's fully urbanised and has very little stormwater treatment. So we can encourage the creation of stormwater treatment systems that will reduce stormwater runoff and clean that water before it enters our waterway. And we can do that in new development areas as well as trying to get those retrofitted into our existing urban zone. We can also get involved in river care groups. We can encourage those that are, are out there doing the good work to improve the health of our river systems. The Christchurch earthquakes were a real tragedy for this city, but out of that has come an opportunity that few established cities ever get, and that is the second chance to create a place where we are in tune with our river and our natural environments we can really show the world how we can work within the ebb and flow of our rivers instead of trying to control and constrain them. And that's a future Christchurch I would love to see.